Sometimes God has you in a place in your life where you really enjoy being. You're seeing him do amazing God-sized things on a regular basis. And then he tells you it's time to close that chapter in your life and move on to the next one. That's exactly what's happened in my life this year. For a long time, I ran a nonprofit mechanic company where my full-time job was fixing cars for broke people for free as a way to share the love of God with people. When I say that my life was unexplainable apart from God and a lot of times it felt like I was living in a story out of the Bible, that's not an exaggeration. I ran that business for 14 years and then this past March, God told me it was time to close it down permanently and to move on. He's called me into full-time online ministry so that I can help other people learn to live by faith and follow Jesus in the way that he taught me to. But I kept objecting and trying to hold on to the past and still trying to fix cars for people. And then in March, God was like, look, you can either keep ministering to one person at a time or, or you can let me use you to have an exponentially bigger impact than you could ever even imagine by teaching tons of other people to help even more people than you ever could on your own. And so this past March, I decided to obey God and permanently stop working on cars for people, which is really hard, especially when I have people that are still calling me going, hey man, I need help with my car. And I gotta tell them no, because I love helping people. But if I don't live in complete obedience to God, I will be outside of his will and I will miss out on getting to experience what he has planned for me next. So I choose to obey no matter how hard it is.